Now, Wolf was born in the 30s in Germany, and then he came over to America. He lived until 2011. He had an extremely successful career, writing over 40 books. He'd always had an interest in helping people with disabilities, and much of his work focused on improving the quality of life for the disabled. I'm going to be talking to you about two of the influential concepts that he coined. Number one, that is the normalization principle. And number two is social role valorization. Now these concepts might sound difficult, but actually they're quite easy to understand. So the first thing to talk about is the normalization principle. And this simply says that disabled people should have the same patterns of everyday living as everybody else. It's work, recreation, housing, and freedom of choice. Normalization had a huge effect on the impact of services available to disabled people in government systems. After normalization came social role valorization, number two. A socially valued role can be any number of things, including an employee, a good neighbor, a friend, a husband, an artist, and so on. And Dr. Wolfensberger suggested that any disabled person has the right to one or more of these things. All social role valorization, or SRV, is about is to support socially valued roles for people with disabilities. Now, in order to achieve those very fair and reasonable goals for people with disabilities in our society, Dr. Wolfensberger had two further concepts, and that was image enhancement and competency enhancement. And they can be for the individual, social systems, friends and family, a close social circle, neighbors, the community, other service providers, or the society at large. So Dr. Wolf Wolfensberger played an important role in shaping the public policy for disability and helped change the way the public perceives disabled people. Thank you.